Luangni Beach Hotels in Kisumu is no more. Famed for its delicious fresh fish, I'm not just saying this, I've enjoyed it myself. The hotel that has been in existence for more than three decades was last night brought down to make way for the expansion of the Kisumu port. Thousands of traders with temporary occupation licenses and short leases within Kenya Railways land along Akamba Line and Luangani Beach in Kisumu had been given a one-month notice to vacate. The notice expires on the 12th of next month, just three days before the official opening of the refurbished port. The demolitions began last night. Distraught traders watched helplessly as the structures that have provided their livelihoods for more than three decades crumbled. Properties are one week cannot even, we are one month cannot even help us to remove all our all our properties in at least 24 business premises have been earmarked for demolition at Luangni area, a development that is likely to cost more than 1,500 residents their sources of income. <laughs> The county government of Kisumu had given them until 10 p.m. last night, while the Kenya Railways notice speaks of August 12th as the deadline. It is a race against time for thousands of traders here in their bid to salvage whatever little property that they can rescue as the deadline first approaches. The government is rehabilitating the Kisumu port at a cost of 2.5 billion shillings in a move aimed at tapping into its economic potential. Okokusa, NTV.